सेंट जॉन द बॉम्बेज टू बी बी हेडेड फाइनली लेट अस गिव ऑनर टू आवर पेटर्स सेंट एंड पे टुगेदर फॉर द वेल बीइंग ऑफ आवर डायसिस फॉर आवर कोऑर्डिनेटर्स एंड फॉर द स्पिरिचुअल इंटेलेक्चुअल इमोशनल एंड फिजिकल ग्रोथ ऑफ अस एंड द सेमिनरियस ऑफ द डायसिस Now I request Bishop Swami to come and start holy mass. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Father, thank you.
I confess to your mind and your heart, and your brothers and sisters, that I can regret this sin in my thoughts and my words, in what I have done and in what I have failed to do, through my faults, through my faults, through my monstrous faults, their past, this many of us have seen, all the angels and saints, and to my brothers and sisters, to pray for me to the Lord our God. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to heaven. Amen.
O God, who will that St. John the Baptist should go ahead of your son, both in his birth and his death. Grant that as he died, a martyr for truth and justice, we too may fight hard for the confession of what we do. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, our Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. Reading from the book of Jeremiah, chapter 1, verses from 17 to 19. The word of the, the, word of the Lord came to me, saying, God, up, up your loins, arise, and say to them everything that I command you. Do not be dismayed by, by them. Lest, lest I dismay you before them. And I, behold, I make you this day of fortified city, um, iron pillar and bronze walls, against the whole land, against the, the kings of Judah. It's, it is prince, princes, it is priests, and the people of the land. They will fight against you, but they shall not prevail against you. For I am with you, says the Lord, to deliver you. The word of God. Thanks. Nice to God.
I want you to give me at once the head of John the Baptist on a platter. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Saint Mark. Lord, 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 Lord. Herod had sent and seized John and bound him in prison for the sake of Herodias, his brother Philip's wife, because he had married her. For John said to Herod, It is not lawful for you to have your brother's wife. And Herodias had a grudge against him and wanted to kill him, but she could not. For Herod feared John, knowing that he was a righteous and holy man, and kept him safe. When he heard him, he was much perplexed, and yet he heard him gladly. But an opportunity came when Herod, on his birthday, gave a banquet for his courtiers and officers and the leading men of Galilee. For when Herodias' daughter came in and danced, she pleased Herod and his guests. And the king said to the girl, Ask me for whatever you wish, and I will grant it. And he vowed to her. Whatever you ask me, I will give you, even half of my kingdom. And she went out and said to her mother, What shall I ask? And she said, The head of John the Baptizer. And she came in immediately with haste to the king and asked, saying, I want you to give me at once the head of John the Baptist on a platter. And the king was exceedingly sorry but because of his oaths and his gates guests he did not want to break his word to her and immediately the king sent a soldier of the guard and gave orders to bring his head he went and beheaded him in the prison and brought his head on a platter and gave it to the girl and the girl gave it to her mother. When his disciples heard of it, they came and took his body and laid it in a tomb. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise Lord Jesus Christ. And the brothers. John the Baptist was the baptizer. He was baptizing the people in the river Jordan. And with their baptism, people were getting confronted. The church tries to tell us about the character of the baptism. The character of the baptism is to make a person new. The character of the baptism is to forgive all the sins. And and the character of the baptism is that after receiving baptism, we become the sons and daughters. We become the heralds of the good news of our Lord Jesus Christ. We become the ambassadors. And John the Baptist, being the baptizer, he was the source of the heralds of the universe. 
He was the source of the And what is the work of the ambassador of our Lord Jesus Christ? The work of the ambassador of our Lord is to fight against injustice. Is to fight against all the evil acts. It is to fight against that evil which is present in the society. And Johnny Baptist, he fought for the moral justice. He fought against the moral injustice which was present in the society. Namely, as we heard in the gospel, that the devil was living in the wife of his brother, which was killing and in her, because she was already married. Therefore, for the for the devil to keep the wife of her brother. He was in hurry and in. And that is what John the Baptist was. And he wanted to establish the moral justice. He wanted to establish the, the source of justice. He wanted to stop this, he wanted to tell the people about the justice of our Jesus. And uh, we are all are the ambassadors of our Lord Jesus Christ right from the beginning of our baptism. And therefore, as John the Baptist for for injustice. I see fought for moral injustice and social injustice. Likewise, uh, in post by the Baptist, we also had to fight against the moral injustice and social injustice. And for that, before we fight against the moral injustice or the social injustice. We have to know what is injustice. And that is why we have come here to learn so that we may know about the justice of our society. So that we may know about the uh, moral values in our life or the moral justice in our life. We may know about uh, our Holy Catholic Church. We may know about Bible. We may know about uh, dogma. We may know about the, the, the moral teaching of the Church. And that is why we are here in order to learn about the moral teaching of the Church. Then only we can engage in justice. And therefore, uh, as we are celebrating the end of uh, John the Baptist, it's the time to reflect on us. How we are preparing ourselves in the future against this injustice, social injustice, moral injustice, and all other injustices which are present in our society. And uh, when 
we celebrate the feast of uh, our Sindhan. This is the time to reflect what we are doing in our life. This is the time to reflect that we are preparing ourselves to be the future priests or to establish the source of the love of justice also. Are we trying our methods? Or when uh, we fail, or when we fail in our method, this is the time to make a new resolution. This is the time to go ahead with a new determination. Time to be do well in our uh, in our daily life. We do well in our studies. We do well in all other activities. And I tell you that uh, this is the place where you can develop your talents and your talents. This is the place where you are given all the all the possibilities, all the all the facilities to develop your talents and uh, to learn about your life. It is not only the learning, uh, it is not only the theoretical learning, but then this is the place where you are taught to learn about your life, where you are taught to learn uh, what you are going to spend uh, your life. Therefore, uh, here, uh, the theoretical knowledge only is not perfect. You are uh, given also uh, the knowledge of uh, how to spend your life uh, properly. How to go ahead uh, in, a, in your profession. How to be That is what we learn here. And uh, we have to be witness by joining the priest among others. We have to uh, uh, be the light and so on. As uh, we hear uh, in the gospel. And for that, and uh, this is the place where uh, we are given opportunity to profit from all the opportunities that is possible. And therefore, uh, you have to know that you have to that this is the place where you can develop all your confidence. After that, there is no any chance to develop your confidence. There is no reason to have to say the names, the quality, the speaker, the quality, the learn, each other talk to you. After that, there is no any attention. After that, you will be busy concentrating yourselves more in spiritual life, more in philosophical subjects, and then afterwards you will uh, uh, talk theology, and therefore you have to devote uh, uh, yourself more in those uh, subjects, and therefore there is not any any opportunity, there is not any place for you to. 
very brave for our friends, brothers, sisters, friends and well wishers who help us directly and indirectly in our vocation. May good God bless them with multiple and numerous graces. We pray for this. Lord, hear our prayer. Today we pray for our Bishop Linu Singhalekka and for his Episcopal ministry. May good Lord give him courage, strength, wisdom and optimal health so that he may lead the places in a prosperous way. We pray for this. Lord, Lord our prayer. Today we pray for all the promoters, priests and brothers who went through this minor seminary. Heavenly Lord, be with them and inspire them all to imitate the first verse life of Saint John the Baptist, so that they may be true witness of justice, peace and happiness. We pray for this. Lord, Lord hear our prayer. Today we would like to pray for our Holy Father Pope Francis. May good Lord shower upon him good health of mind, body and spirit abundantly, so that bring healthy he may guide the universal church in a proper way. We pray for this. Lord, Lord, Today we pray for our benefactors and well-wishers. O loving Lord, keep them under your protective care and fulfill their desires and prayer. We pray for this. Lord, hear our prayer. Lord, you know our needs and necessities. Hear our prayers and fulfill them. We ask this. Amen. Grant that we may make straight your path. 
pass. I stood by the voice crying in the desert, St. John the Baptist, who powerfully sealed his teaching by the shedding of his blood. Amen. Lord, we need you. And with the Spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let's give thanks to our Lord God. He is right and just. It is truly right and just. Our duty and our salvation. Always and everywhere to give you thanks. God, Holy Father Almighty and Eternal God. To Christ our Lord. In his percursor, Saint John the Baptist. We praise your great glory for you consecrated him for a singular honor among those born of women. His birth brought great rejoicing. Even in the womb, he leaped for joy. At the coming of human salvation, he alone of all the prophets pointed out the land of redemption and to make holy the flowing waters. He baptized the very water of baptism and was privileged to bear him supreme witness by the shedding of his blood. And so, with powers of heaven, we worship you constantly on earth and before your majesty without end. Therefore, O Lord, we humbly before you, 
by the same Spirit, graciously made for it these gifts which we have brought to you for the salvation, that they may become the body and blood of the Lord of Jesus, our Lord Jesus Christ, and by whose command we celebrate these mysteries. For, for one week, on the night he was buried, he is set to bread, and giving thanks, he said the blessing, broke the bread, and gave it to his disciples, saying, To take this all of you, and eat it of you, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was conducted, he took the chalice and, and giving thanks, he did set up the lesson and gave the chalice to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many, for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. Let's proclaim the mystery of faith. Then we hope and enjoy forever the goodness of your glory to 
has traveled on to the rest of the world for that
Happy are we those who are happy to be someone? Amen. Amen. Let's go in peace. Amen. Amen.